Yo, what's up, guys? Uh -oh. There we go. All righty. Come on, guys. What's up? Whew. It has been a while since I have played any Metal Gear Solid game. Let's play one that I haven't played yet. Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker. I don't know what the reaction was to this game. So, uh, I've been to it. Man, do I miss that Metal Gear sound. Mm. Mm. Input your player name. You may only use a... Okay. Uh, let's see... For me, another. You not capitalize. Wait, it says shift. Oh, I see. I see what we need to do. Derp. Mm, looks good. Okay, it is. Select your control team. Control the camera with your right hand. Okay, the configuration is similar to that to Metal Gear Solid 4. It's probably what I'll want to do. Action type. Control the cam camera with your left hand. MPO. What's MPO? We're, we're leaving it as shooter type, that's for sure. Weapon select, auto aim. Guess we'll just leave it as is. We could probably always change it later. We've already done the data installation feature. Aha. Here was 1964. The world was firmly in the grip of the Cold War, divided into East and West. One of America's heroes had defected to the Soviet Union. Ouch. Yay. <clears throat> She was known as Da Boss, or The Boss, mother of the Special Forces. Soldiers said to have led the Allies to victory in World War II. However, the American made miniature nuclear warhead she took with her was destroyed, was to destroy a Soviet facility, I think. Facing full scale nuclear war, the leaders of the world's superpowers held top secret talks to avert Armageddon. The Soviet Union wanted assurance that this was not the work of Uncle Sam wanted America to eliminate one of its legendary soldiers, the boss. Yes, recapping Snake Eater. The person assigned this mission was her close apprentice, the soldier known as Snake. Anguish journey into enemy territory, eventually confronting and killing the boss. Having saved the world, Snake was hailed a true hero and was given the title of Big Boss. Naked Snake. Liquid. Following the award ceremony, however, Snake disappeared.
Oh, soldiers without borders. Oh no, his cigar. He couldn't light it. Rip. Ooh, training in the rain. And that beautiful CQC, baby. doing the tutorials it's been a while all right so the buttons are actual control look alive ladies the boss is gonna join us show them how it's done boss your first priority in enemy territory is knowing your surroundings your life depends on where you are looking and how fast you can identify your targets therefore you must first master moving your line of sight. To move your line of sight, use the camera buttons. Now, when I give you an order, look in that direction. Look up. Good. Look down. Good. You should be familiar with the up and down camera buttons now. Press the action button if you're ready to move on. Okay. Well, wait. Next, we'll check your left and right. Look right. Good. Look left. Good. You should be familiar oh, I... with the left and right camera buttons now. Press the action button if you're ready to move on. I did the opposite. Whoops. But it counted. Okay. You can change the controls anytime in options. Go with well, the method good. that works best for you. Next, I'll explain how to change stances. If you just stand there like an idiot in front of an enemy, you might as well kill yourself now. At Very times, true. You will need to get low to avoid detection. You have three stances. Stand, crouch, and lying down. To change stances, use the crouch button. Tap the crouch button to change between standing and crouching. You can move in either stance. Hold the crouch button and keep it held to lie down. However, you cannot move while you are lying down. I'll say that again. You cannot move while lying down. Is that clear? Why? Good. Next, we'll work on your movement. Use the analog stick to move around. Tilt it a little to walk slowly. Tilt it further to run. Decide which to use based on your situation. Remember that your footsteps are louder when running, making you easier to discover. Be careful. Okay. Good. Now we have rolling. Rolling is useful for knocking down enemies in your way and for getting away when surrounded. You can also use it to jump over small ditches and other obstacles. To Fancy. Roll, tap the attack button while running. You got that? Tap the attack button while running! Don't forget it! Quite angry. That's it! Next, I will explain how to attack without gunfire. You may run into an enemy unexpectedly. You may not have a weapon on you. Or you may be out of ammo. You'll still need an effective attack strategy. One well-placed strike and the enemy won't know what hit him. To strike an enemy, press the attack button while standing still. On my command, press the attack button repeatedly and take down your opponent. Go. I'm ready, boss. Ready for a beaten soldier. Impressive, boss. Next, we're gonna practice using the stun rod. Hitting and that boy with a stun rod will shock them with a million and a half volts. Anyone on the receiving end of that is guaranteed to be out cold. Ouch. To use the stun rod, press the aim button to ready it, then press the attack button. 
You'll be glad to know we're using mock stun rods for this training session. When your partner attacks, make him believe it's the real deal. Prepare yourself for stun rod training. Go! I'm ready, boss. Impressive, boss! Now, we'll move on to CQC. CQC, or Close Quarters Combat, refers to when engaging an enemy in battle at yeah. very close range. It is a quick and efficient way of eliminating a threat. There are various CQC techniques. We will go over each of them. Hooray. Don't get cocky because you think you know them. Oh. This will be different from what you're used to. Pretend That's you are so. learning it for the first time. Okay. The first technique is throwing your opponent. To do this, position yourself near your opponent and press the attack button while you tilt the analog stick. Be sure to press the attack button when the icon appears. Now, wait for my command and throw your I opponent. remember this. I was Go. never super good with it. I'm ready, boss. All right. So when an enemy is near... That is incorrect, boss! There we go. Fine work, boss! Next, I'm going to teach you how to restrain an opponent close to you. This is a cornerstone of CQC. Grab hold of an enemy, and the bastard's life is in your hands. What you do from yeah, there the is grab. up to you. Never... Just know that if you restrain him for too long, the what is it, forward and attack? I remember right from Snake Eater. Let's begin. To restrain your opponent, hold down the attack button while near them. Restrain your opponents on my command. No, oh, just hold down. Go. I'm ready, boss. <laughs> Impressive, <laughs> boss. Start talking. Now we will throw your opponent after restraining. Start talking. Him. To throw an enemy to the ground, press a direction on the analog stick when you have them restrained. Restrain your opponent and throw them on my command. Go. I'm ready, boss. That is incorrect, boss! Fine work, boss! He says now when it's on my CQC command and he doesn't say anything. Enemy opponents. You can also take out a group of enemies by throwing an opponent you have restrained. First, restrain an opponent by pressing the attack button near them. Then tilt the analog stick to throw them. By tilting the analog stick toward other enemies, you can send your captive flying straight into them. On my command, restrain and then throw your opponent. Go! I'm ready, boss. That is incorrect, boss! Yeah, how are... The enemy is... incorrect, boss! That is incorrect, boss! Tilt the analog stick while restraining the opponent, boss! That is incorrect, boss! Okay. That is incorrect, boss! The enemy is, is near. Incorrect, boss. I'll explain it again! Yeah, what the hell am I supposed First, to do? First, restrain an opponent by pressing the attack button near them. Okay. Then tilt the analog stick to throw them. By tilting the analog stick toward other enemies, you can send your captive flying straight into them. On my command, restrain and then throw your opponent. Go! Yeah, this is where the... I'm ready, boss. I get confused with... <laughs> That is incorrect, boss! Okay. Fine work, boss! Oh, so I just had to hit Again. the guy? Well, that's annoying. Go. I'm ready, boss. Man, that's gonna be difficult. Fantastic! All right! Why don't we do something special since the boss is here? All right. Anyone who feels like getting their ass kicked, step forward. Don't hold back, boss. When you're surrounded by multiple enemies, you'll have to take them on one after the other. To do it, 
Simply press the attack button again while throwing the current enemy. Just be sure to wait for the icon to appear. Go! I'm ready, boss. I'm ready, boss. <laughs> Next. Boss, press the attack button when the icon appears. Boss, press the attack button when the icon appears. Boss, press the attack button when the icon appears. Boss, press the attack button when the icon appears. Next. Next. Fine work, boss! Again! Go! I'm ready, I'm boss. Ready, boss. <laughs> boss! Press the attack button when the icon appears! Next! Next! Fine work, boss! Because they really want you to throw and the enemies. Stop. That's it for today. Makes sense. Thank Knock him out. Snake. I've never felt so more alive. Snake. Oh, this is a pre-rendered cutscene. What's going on, Kaz? We've got guests. Time to move. Don't worry, it's not our friends from Langley. I brought him, made sure we won't follow. Thank you, Big Boss. Call me Snake. Oh, uh, sorry, Big Boss. <sighs> Big Boss. Listen up. For us, there is no victory. But in revolution, doesn't one triumph or die? We don't do either. I don't get why they put the gloss filter over the speech bubbles, but maybe it's because it was raining. Find out now. Here. Ah, uh, thank you. Feel like a new man. There's no coffee like Costa Rican coffee. So, what brings a distinguished scholar from the Costa Rican government to Colombia? Professor Galvez comes from Costa Rica's University for Peace. Ooh. You see, over the past year, there have been sightings of an armed group in Costa Rica. They're not ours, of course. Costa Rica doesn't have an army. Correct. Article 12 of our constitution states that the army as a permanent institution is abolished. The peace constitution. You think it's rebels who fled Nicaragua? Hmm. No, Sorry if you see no, my... They don't appear to be guerrillas. They're far too organized. That's in what What's the... your government's take? That pop up when I open up the menu? The authorities in San Jose claim it's a multinational security firm. That's not. Hired by the Development Corporation of Costa Rica. They'll see my mouse, apparently. Lies, obviously. They're bringing in state-of-the-art weaponry and equipment by the shipload. Hmm. Where'd they get that kind of cash? I fear La Cia may be involved. The CIA. As you both know, the United States views Central America as its backyard. Even after Cuba, we've managed to maintain a delicate balance with the U.S. And your government can't just give them the boot. We are not allowed to bear arms. Second Amendment infringement. Japan's constitution has something similar. Article 9. It says Japan renounces war and can't maintain an army. 
I understand that you and your men have neither state nor ideology, that you will fight any foe. Please, you must drive them out of our defenseless country. We come to you, the Militaire Sans Frontières. So, you want to hire us? Yes, as our deterrent. We can't afford to pay much, it's true. But... We can offer you this. A forward operating base. An offshore plant in the Caribbean. Sounds pretty good to me. This place is becoming a mess anyway. Snake, we need some place we can settle down. The government's agreed to cooperate. Unofficially, of course. A chopper for transport would be nice, too. I'll see what I can do. Hold it. You seem to think we're just a pack of dogs of war. Is that right? Yes, that's what I've heard. You're an army without a state. No, we've only left our countries behind. Please, you must help us. If your suspicions are true, force isn't gonna do any good. You'll have to find a political solution. The government's hands are tied. Go back to your bosses in San Jose. Tell them if they want, I'll introduce them to a negotiator I know. No. I'm not here on their behalf. Ooh. So, what are you doing here? For over 20 years, I've preached the virtues of peace at multiple universities. Tonight, I stand before you as an educator. This is my student. She came to me to study peace. Her name is Paz. Paz Ortega. Paz. Ortega. Paz. Peace. No kidding. That's my name too. Kazuhira. It's Japanese for peace. What a coincidence. Pleased to meet you, Paz. Call me... Kaz. Uh. They've got a supply port north of Puerto Limon. He's a mute. A town in the know. Costa del Mar Caribe. A few days ago, Paz stumbled upon that facility while searching for a lost friend. She was captured. She's only a child. Sixteen years old. They did terrible things to her. But somehow she managed to escape. Oh. My God. She's Huerfana. Her mother died when she was small. And she lost her grandparents in the Civil War. That sucks. She hates war with a passion like no other. My name is Paz, and I will do anything to protect my namesake. It is my one and only purpose. Please, get them out of my country. Make them leave Costa Rica. Sorry, kid. We know who you are, big boss. That is why we've come to you. Uh-oh. Oh, <laughs> word gets around. I mean, our soldiers were just crying it out in the storm. Prologue, an army without borders. The supply facility at Puerto de la Ba will support where Haas was imprisoned and obtained intel on the bases. Computer type action. See, I want to know what the difference is. Through this channel. Keep 
Keep your headphones on at all times and pay attention. Also, make sure no one else can listen in. Snake, are you clear on the controls? Take a minute to refresh your memory. Use the analog stick to move. Use the directional buttons to change views. To change your settings, use the start button to open the menu. Oh, why would you you what? That doesn't make any sense. I, I am not happy with that one. What about Hunter? Okay, how do I aim? That's controls. Doesn't make any sense. The hunter. I'm not happy with how they did this. <laughs> I'm saying that right now. Why are they inverted? Auto aim. Aim assist enabled. Here we go. Why would you invert that? Aim character direction camera. Oh, now you tell me that the tranquilizer? Ah. I'm not happy with the camera, like how to control. Why would you program it like this? I gotta look up like, we do like custom mapping. That would be fantastic. We could. That's right. Nicely done, boss. Why is it auto Oh, this cannot be the case. Let's see. Black button, auto aim, switch. Inverse, inverse. Aim mode, initial direction. Activate only while action button is held. The 
facility you're headed for is past that fence. A grenade should be able to take out that gate. Grenades explode. You throw them, Snake. Use the L button to ready throwing weapons. Once you've readied a weapon, throw with the R button. When using throwing weapons, hold the attack button down longer to throw farther. You won't throw the weapon until you let go of the button. I don't know, we'll find out. I gotta thank you for agreeing to this snake. Man, am I glad to be out of here. Finally, we can leave all that crap in San Geronimo behind. Break into the mercenary business for real. Let me guess. You're doing it for her, aren't you? For her. For her. Are they still here? Come on, Snake. This could be good for us. They're willing to give us an offshore plant. A place we can finally put down some roots. This is our chance to expand MSF. We don't need a place to stay, guys. We're nomads. We always will be. What? You'd rather keep wandering from conflict to conflict? Tools in the hands of whoever's fighting at the time? The second we settle down, who's to say we won't become the warmongers? Listen to me, Snake. We're not mercenaries. We're not a foreign legion. MSF's a business. A new kind of business. <sighs> Look, it's not like we're trying to start a war here. All we need to do is find out who this security company really is. Come on, Kaz. It's pretty obvious that they're backed by the CIA. Wait a sec. That would mean... Our friend, the Professor, is likely KGB. I see. We'd be making an enemy of our homeland. And there'd be no turning back. Ah, this damn thing won't light. Huh? Put on some coffee, Kaz. It's time for a little chat with the Professor. Time for some beatings. Or not. smoker when I got my medal from the secretary general he gave me this prosthetic hand as well but smoking was ruining my lungs so I quit I've not had much use for it since it's quite an honor to meet the legendary big boss that's just a code name the CIA made up then perhaps I should call you John I don't have a name. You stopped using that code name you liked so much ten years ago. <laughs> what about you, comrade? What do they call you back at center? Well then, allow me to get straight to the point. Yes, please. <laughs> please. Land as slim as a whip, hot as torture. That's the Chilean poet. Neruda. Central America is the navel of the American continents bridging north and south. Mm. We want this land. We'll build a socialist stronghold, then use it to split the Americas in two. America would lose its backyard. And with it, its economic production, shipping lanes, and strategic value. We, on the other hand, would gain a base from which all of Latin America would be well within our reach. He who controls Central America will win this Cold War. First comes Nicaragua, toppling the pro-American Somoza regime. In preparation, we've begun instigating anti-Somoza sentiment 
and providing aid to the Sandinista National Liberation Front. Hmm. You're manipulating Sandinista into overthrowing Somoza for you. After the revolution, Nicaragua will become a socialist state. You think America's just gonna let that happen? Certainly not. After all, the CIA is already here. And that's the armed group inside Costa Rica. Precisely. It's clear that they've been sent in to disrupt our efforts across the border in Nicaragua. Hmm. Simply put, the army now stationed in Costa Rica is CIA capital. But it's more complex than that. The CIA's got something else planned as well. What? That is the million dollar question. Big boss, we want you and your unit to find the answer. I'm trying to see if there's a way to Infiltrate like... Infiltrate and investigate the facility in La Costa where Paz was imprisoned. Learn all you can of their operations. Hexter then scale or drive something. Drive them out of the country. You're asking us to settle a turf war between the KGB and the CIA. What about her? That was all just an act? Hmm. You mean her words about peace? She was captured, that much is true. But I've kept my KGB affiliation from her. And you thought we'd fall for a sob story? No. Oh, here I we go. Post-processing shader. There we go. She managed to escape with her life. Bothering the crap on me. I don't know why so that was put in, established. Why were they attacked? I believe this will help explain. Perhaps they saw something they weren't supposed to. ESP color. Perhaps What's that? They heard something they shouldn't have. A cassette tape? Pass took this during her escape. She says her friend happened to record it by accident. A cartoon, What's inverse that? color, sh sharpen. A portable stereo cassette. Oh, that looks player, awful. The first of its kind. Ooh, fancy. Ah, I heard they were working on something like that in Japan. Oh, that looks awful. Didn't know you guys were too. I believe what you're about to hear will help you understand. If we do. What is that? A Quetzal? The Phoenix Bird. Paz's friend was researching birds. She went out into the jungle to record bird calls. Yeah, we'll just leave it turned Stumble off. On this. I could make it to where that's kind of... So? So what? Now it gets interesting. Voice print analysis confirms that this voice is indeed that of the legendary hero and criminal, the boss. What? The other hasn't been identified. Well, what a twist. In her 30s with a British accent. The song playing in the background was a hit in 1973. What's it going to be? Loyalty to your country or loyalty to me? Your country or your mentor? Your mission? For your beliefs, I... I am loyal to oh, myself. Is I'm in Costa Rica. I think I like this one. Give it on here. As I understand it, she was your commander. Fought by A little bit side. sharper. And that you killed her under orders from the CIA. Thus surpassing her to become the hero known as Big Boss. <sighs> It's gotta be a trap. So you still can't turn your back on your country. Then I suppose you won't need this.
right. Snake? I'll do it for the girl. For Paz. Okay. <laughs> for peace, then. And there we go. What a twist. Yeah, the game looks... I mean, that's the loading. It looks a little... I wonder what happens if we just turn it off. Yeah, that looks fine. Good enough are. for me. CIA Mercs. Snake, you've got to get past them undetected. Avoid combat whenever possible. This is a sneaking mission. Hide behind stuff. Take the long way around. Whatever it takes to stay out of sight. Your gun is a last resort. It could just as easily kill you as save you. <laughs> to press up against a wall, face it and hit the action button. From that position, you can press the L button to detect enemies. That also works while lying down. Not enough room, huh? We'll keep it here at the base. I really wish you could control... Serves as a compass and shows sound sources. Pay attention to your surroundings. The percentage in the upper right is your camo index. The lower the number, the more easily you'll be spotted. Conspicuous movements and loud noises will compromise your camo index. Your fatigues will act as camouflage. jungle you'll be there head east uh. <laughs> ah crap The controlling the camera thing is going to get me good. I'll... Hmm, I might be able to... Possibly map it. I'm actually going to take a quick little restroom break. I'll be right back momentarily. BRB.
All right, we're back. Uh, I was reading online, and obviously with like the PS3 360 version, they've made it more like the modern shooter. That might be something to where if we don't get too far into the game today, maybe we'll try switching over to that one. Or I can adjust to how it's set up now. Understood. Return to base. Why does it auto look up? Huh. Somebody there? We're under attack. Ah oh, man, this sucks. Just go balls to the walls deep. fucked up can we just like reload your solid death screen. If you do end up having to fight, CQC can be your best friend. But keep in mind, you can only use it when equipping a handgun or the stun rod. <laughs> Press the attack button near the enemy to initiate close quarters combat. Not enough room, huh? We'll keep it here at the base. Dude, this is gonna kill me. <laughs> the indicator in the upper right serves as a compass and shows sound sources. Pay attention to your surroundings. Man, is there not like a default adjust? The percentage in the upper right is your camo index. The lower the number, the more easily you'll be spotted. Conspicuous movements and loud noises will compromise your camo index. Your fatigues will act as camouflage.
inside the compound. Security is tight. Stay sharp. Oh, excuse me. Ugh. Your objective is the building to the east. Oh gosh, I weaseled my way in there. Yes, sir, we broke him. We acquired the whereabouts of target 500. Acknowledged. Spears are loaded. The barge is cleared, Point Bravo. Acknowledged. Freeze! The cargo. Where's it headed? What is it? Your suit. In the mountains. What's up there? Why didn't we just do that instead of throwing him? found a radio it's got a circuit that reverses the audio phase let's switch frequencies from time to time just to make sure we're not detected i found a map of their bases the cargo's heading from the marshes west towards irasu nice going boss Kaz, this place is full of film badges dozens of them film badges like the ones used to measure radiation exposure <sighs> the radio man was wearing one 
and whoever he was talking to called the cargo Spears. Wait, that would mean... They have the Spear of Destiny. They're bringing nukes into Costa Rica. Uh-oh. Holy Mother of God. Gasp, what do we do? We bring peace, of course. Peace Walker. Cutscene interaction bonus. Like, I should have expected that to happen. Got a smoke grenade design. How's that map, Snake? Think you can use it? Uh, it tells me where their bases are, but it's just a bunch of points. No routes. I need better intel on the lay of the land. Snake, the professor said he's got the Sandinistas on his side. Said you should get in touch with the FSLN Commandante. Hmm. Do they know they're backed by the KGB? Nah. As far as they know, they're really fighting for the revolution. The KGB is staying behind the scenes. I'm not sure the Sandinistas are aware of what's really going on. Still can't believe anybody would bring nukes here. Yeah, I know! That's a shocker. Costa Rica's party to the Tlatel Loco Treaty, which declares Latin America a nuke-free zone. Based on Japan's three non yeah, nuclear sure. principles, it bans the testing, use, import, or deployment of nuclear weapons. If word of this gets out, Opino will be forced to act. It'll cause an international uproar. The treaty was signed to prevent another Cuban Missile Crisis. If the U.S. itself is gonna scrap it... Latin America is too close to spawning another Cuba or two already. The entire continent would become one big powder keg. Well, if they did... Hey, the nukes, powder keg. can't let them get away with it. It's me! Are you planning a test? Show when I'm off? mad. Or is it all to keep the anti-American movement in check? Good question. Why bring them here? I can't figure it out. Whatever the CIA's up to in Costa Rica, the professor wants it stopped. We need to find out what that something is. We need to get ready first, Kaz. Repairs? Working as fast as we can, boss. This place is pretty beat. It looks like hell. But as long as you're with us, we'll make it heaven. As long as no I'm here. No state telling us what to do. This is the MSF's haven, our mother base. And with this foothold, we'll back you up even better than before. Good old mother base. Pile of junk into something big. Welcome to Mother Base. Developing new weapons to collecting intel. Yeah, we gotta get my hush puppy. So we've got Miller in there, the brig.
get him in the development area. Weapons used in missions. The funds, the GIMP. GMP. Alright. Well, I want. Yeah, I want my. Give me that. That's what I want. Gotta get my. Gotta get those silent pistols up as much as possible I will be getting those headshots when I can oh, a machine gun huh here we got oh an empty mag Get a smoke grenade going. Anything with our stun rod. I think that's probably going to take a while. I would have known that the PS3 and or the 360 had the better controls than I'm used to. I thought for some reason that the PSP had uh, two joysticks. Well, go ahead and do another mission. Like the mission you wish to participate in, use the L and R switch. Not gonna be doing any co-op. Just slowly I know. giving her information you, about how he's friend. not who he says Snake. he is. Snake, if you need to know about Costa Rica, the geography, the climate, the wildlife, anything, 
Just ask me. I know about its history and laws, too. We learned it all in school. Got it. I have a question I'll ask. I, uh... What? In school. I also learned that peace is an unnatural state for human society. And that war is a constant threat to our relationships with others. That's right. So, to achieve peace, we have to create it ourselves. Crying about it won't bring it about or make it last. Each one of us must go and seek it out. That's why you we'll use force. Making sacrifices. No offense, but I don't know what peace is. Never felt what it's like. Huh. Never even been interested in it. Snake. Snake? Oh, sorry. Sorry Listen, for being a Debbie uh, Downer. ideas are admirable. I hope they turn out to be right. Yeah, me too. You bringing any peace weapons? Your name. Of course not. Who better to You're not changing that? anything. Thanks, Snake. If only Rambo was here. Rambo would just straight up tell her the truth. See you later. Snake, use your radio to call people, but stay alert. You're in the middle of a mission and can't afford to let your guard down. Got it. Need to know more about Costa Rica? Paz can help you out. Good to know. We'll follow their transport route. This should take us straight to their main base. From what I've seen, it looks like nukes. Agreed. The key thing now is to confirm whether those spears really are what we think they are. And if so, why they're here. Follow the transport route. Find the nukes. That's what I'm thinking. First, we should make contact with the Sandinistas. Find them Dante. nukes. They can tell us more about what's up ahead. But it looks like their hideouts already come under attack. We better hope they're still alive. Snake, infiltrate that cabin and secure the Sandinistas' commandante. Neutralize any guards by knocking them out, putting them to sleep, or even using the Fulton recovery system. You choose how to handle it, boss. I'm assuming we just listened to the... this map you've got a lot of different to swamp along the river a boat repair cabin All right, missing prep. We go naked snake if we wanted to. All right, got our rations, the love box. We could get some tea to recover our psyche. I think we got all we needed to. Let's uh, take, a, take a stab at this one. Chapter one, a country without an army. Get why it automatically like does it not want the radio you just picked up by pressing the start button to open the menu window you know you can assign the radio to the select button by choosing options from the menu window
We'll keep it here at the base. And go that way. Okay, is there not a way to make that to stop auto? Like, it always wants to auto look up. Run, you dumb mother. Jeez. The boathouse should be close by. Neutralize the security detail and make contact with the Commandante. Neutralize the soldiers. You might even tranquilize or knock them out. Oh, well, we're trying. Who's that? What is it? Oh, come on. There we go.
enemies close. Really? You've been spotted. Run for it. It's either that or take out every last enemy soldier. I'm excited to meet you now. Understood that area is not part of the mission. Yeah. That was awful. Oh, come on, get off. Try and throw him off your trail. Go in the building. Oh my gosh. What is it? What happened? Ugh. Camera angle rolls are getting me good. Camera angle, dude. It's bullshit. Good. You shook them. They're still looking, though. Don't make it easy for them. I guess I had to neutral. Oh, yeah, that's right. It said I had to neutralize everything. That was not good, in my opinion. You're his daughter. Then that makes you his delegato, right? Relax, I'm not your enemy. Cuban. Mm -hmm. Cigar? I'll take whatever you've got. <laughs> Just waving a cigar in front of this person's face. I one, but I prefer cigarettes, you know. Oh, well, I well. A little like El Che, no? You Cubano? Mm, Colombiano. A photographer. I came to Costa Rica to take pictures of birds. Birds? Yeah, uh, Quetzals. You've got no telephoto lens. How do you get your shots? Telephotos for amateurs. It's all in the timing. Oh. Yeah. Let me smoke okay. too. We can talk until I finish this. Chico! Tell me what's going on here. This place is crawling with soldiers. They don't look like private security, more like hired guards. They're loaded with the latest gear from all over the world. Lucky I ducks. Heard a security force hired by Codessa. <laughs> yeah, and I'm Papa Nowhere. Those guys are UCLA's. UCLA's? La Cia. I saw them setting up shop in town. They're planning to do here what they did in Chile. If that's the case, what are they after? Whatever it is, it's not us. You don't think they're here to push you back into Nicaragua? 
Impossible. Too much hardware. Too many bases. Didn't you see? They've got helicopters, tanks. It's like we're in Da Nang. There must be something else. They have a base near here. There's a factory to the north, across a suspension bridge. Factory to the north, across a bridge. Hey, that's where we were gonna go. Have you seen the big transport boat? Mercenary crew on Rio del Jade. You mean the barge? It's upstream from here. Up toward Yasu. Hmm. Any idea what's on it? I could introduce you to some of our compas up there. But I don't recommend going to the mountains. We've lost a lot of people there. They take us captive, torture us for information about our compass, and then they kill us like pigs. Got it. All right. This was our last hideout, the final refuge for El Frente, after being pushed out of Nicaragua and into this peaceful paradise of Costa Rica. Then, El Monstruo attacked. A monster. Y mi viejo. Mi viejo, papá, tú eres la esperanza, our hope. Now that papá's gone, my sister's la comandante de la revolución. Do not listen to him. Papá was a hero who fought by Sandino's side. I am only his daughter. You need a special talent to become cacique. It takes someone great to unite all of las compas. Sorry to interrupt, but leaders don't choose themselves. Neither do heroes. You carry on his legacy of La Esperanza, and they'll follow you, no question. You think so? My compas trust me, but not one of them calls me Comandante. Amanda! <laughs> See what I mean? El Colibri! <laughs> My cigar. Ah. Oh. An unmanned weapon! A robot! <laughs> Why the twist? Got an A somehow. The following words can be now infused with heroic spirit here. Thing. Whatever it was, it looked unmanned. Unmanned? I'd 
heard rumors, but an operational unit? What the hell is going on here? Not to quote Amanda, but the hardware they've got here isn't just unusual. It's overkill, which means one thing. It's nukes. So the question now becomes why... Always we nukes. make that call yet. We need more intel. How? Our source is dead. But his daughter isn't. Good thinking. We can follow her. Head for the next outpost and make contact with Amanda if she's still alive. Roger. Well, how's about that? Personnel report has arrived. A report has arrived from R&D team. Ooh. What do we got? Is my my upgrade to my sweet silence tranquilizer done? Hooray. Ooh, and we got a disposable rocket launcher. An alligator. He went up due to experience in combat unit. Somebody in the medical team, level 27 or higher. The intel team. probably gonna go ahead and call it for tonight because I want to see if I can manage to get a hold of maybe an, the PS3 or the 360 version because the buttons are getting me good I could probably adapt to them but man they're annoying unless I can find I mean I can either ha remap everything or like maybe find an already mapped out thing or something that can just be installed. Not exactly sure. Actually, I'm curious what, uh, curious what cheats there are. Camouflage rain 100%. Full triangle, the development of legislations, which looked no idea what that means. Oh, here we go. There's more. Game fixes. Wide screen hacks. Force frames per second to run at 20 to 30. The original value. Controller cheats. Here we go. Ooh, right analog aim. That is what I want. Wires to map emulated right analog. Does that mean we have to turn that on? Then turn that on?
Ooh, target, target practice. We'll just do this. There's a special treat you can practice freely on any of the targets in the shooting range today. Shoot away. When you're done, head over to the exit. All right, let's see if this actually... See if this actually enabled it. It'd be so nice if it did. Welcome to the shooting range. Just the place for a little target practice, huh? When you're done, head over to the exit. It's not... Huh. It hasn't changed anything. Let me go back. Huh. That's not still not doing it. I'll have to mess around with it and figure out what's up. Yeah, I'm gonna or if worse comes to worse, like I said, find a get get the HD collection. Just go through that way. But yeah, I'm going to call it for tonight, so anybody who enjoyed it so far, feel free to smash the subscribe and punch the like button. Ring the bell to get notified when I go live. I'm like, I mean, I'm definitely liking the story so far. I just, I completely forgot that the PSP does, didn't have, uh, only had the le a left joystick. I could have sworn it had, like, another one. But, eh. I, I never had a PSP. All right. Well, you guys have a good rest of your night. Take care. Uh, let's see. Tomorrow, keep an eye out because uh might be doing something. So until then, God bless. Take care. And I'll catch you on the flip side. See ya.